Welcome to No Strings Attached Street Ministry. Well, today we got some good news. I guess what we're going to do is what everyone calls an unboxing, you could say. But anyway, I um, finally got my inverter, hopefully. So let's go over here and we'll get this unboxed. It finally come in. This is from China. <laughs> of course, one ain't from China. Right? But anyway, we're going to do an unboxing here. And hopefully this is the part we finally need to finish up our electrical system. Remember, before the inverter went bad, so the uh, problem that we had with the inverter was that it was only getting um, about 87 volts. And it was one of those uh, modified sine wave inverters. It was a 1500 inverter, but um, this one here we went to a 2500 pure sine wave inverter. So hopefully this one will be exactly what we need to get the proper power in there anyway for the air conditioner. Because the other one would sometimes would start the compressor on the air conditioner, sometimes it wouldn't. And I think a lot of that was because of the low, vo the, uh, low voltage. But um, instead of going through all the hassle of that, we decided just to get the pure sine wave this time. Now this one is a 120 volt inverter. And it also uh, is 2500 watts. And this is the continuous power 2500. So I think it surges up to like three or four thousand so hopefully it'll uh, do a good job on what we need it to do and so far it looks pretty nice sure packed it all right Ooh, look bubble wrap this is what you use and you ain't got nothing else to do well, anyway let's get back to the inverter <laughs> that'll be our play thing later on Be the right specs, don't it, Warren? It does. Nice digital display. Whole lot, whole lot longer than the other one. You might have to reposition it somehow. So this one should have. The fans that are thermostatically controlled should have uh, okay, I don't know what all these are. Oh these are all these different plugs. Hmm, have to read up on that and see <laughs> just what those are. Never seen one like that before. But uh, she looks like a multi-terminal for different voltages. We'll have to see. It's supposed to be 110 volt. It's supposed to be... Uh, let's look here and see what it says. DC to AC. Come on, focus. Not really want to focus in on there. There's DC input volts 12, DC 12 volts out, AC output. 
AC uh, 110 to 120 volt frequency is 60 Hertz so it should be exactly what we pure sine wave power inverter so it should be what we need so we'll get back to you once we get this thing installed and I'll do a install on the electrical system we'll do some testing all right thanks anyway bye